Yeah, Kids on a one here today. This is lesson two of um, Google SketchUp. I'm just going to be showing you the rest of the tools and demonstrating them to you on this box. So first of all, let's do the arc tool. I'm just going to draw a little arc right here. So we, we're going to click right up here. There's an arc tool. What is that? Click that, and then wherever we want to draw the line of the arc, we just click, drag, like we're dragging a normal line, then click again, and then move your mouse up and down, no clicking needed here, and it'll just make an arc. So I'm going to move it up to the top there. Now, this and this are two separate surfaces, so I can grab push-pull, push this down there, push this down there. That's pretty nice, right? So now, you can erase this line, and this is the eraser tool right there. When you drag it over a line, say we have a ton of lines right here we don't want. All right. Okay, so we click the eraser tool, click and drag it over all the lines we want to erase, and they'll turn blue, and we let go and they go away. So now, that was the arc tool and the eraser tool. Um, it's pretty much all the other tools I have to show you. All the other ones are pretty much irrelevant, other than the circle tool, which is pretty straightforward. You just align this with the center. You just click, drag out, unclick, face a circle. Shoulder stupid. Apple Z. So um, it's the circle tool, etc. I'm just gonna go inside of this. And draw a simple little room, like a square. Take this up to the roof. Actually, let's make a bunk bed or something. Now, yeah. Another thing is with the paint bucket. Cool little thing you can do you can do translucent things. So I'm going to click the paint bucket and I can go in here and do translucent and then there are all these forms of glass I can just use. They're all transparent. Pretty nice. So um yeah, with this you can make doors however you want to with push-pull. You can color things in. You can really do whatever you want. Now, I'll just remind you, if you want to delete a surface, you click the eraser tool and hold control while clicking the surface and then click erase. Or click the mouse button, select something, press the delete key. Delete. Nothing left. Then to save, you just go up to File, Save, and you know, do your normal save. So, um, that's pretty simple. So, uh, thank you for watching. Um, uh, if you want to uh, subscribe to us, that's cool. Subscribe to MacEds101 and uh, goodbye.